Random Idiot Messages Part 2. Meet Adriana, 2012. Thanks for being a great fan of Matt Bomer. He really appreciates your kind comments and support. You have been randomly selected amongst others to have a personal conversation with him directly. He personally told us to help him do this as he does not write anyone on Instagram or Facebook due to lots of fans. Warm regards to you. Ensure to disregard any imposter here on Instagram or Facebook claiming to be Matt Bomer for he does not write here! Exclamation points. I said, sorry, but who's Matt Bomer? I've never commented on anyone called that. Why would you think I did? Well, we have been going through his comments and found you there. And they actually did. I think I wrote RIP under something or other. I can't even remember. Check if you can see yourself there. I said, I have zero recollection on, of commenting that. Who died? And why is your profile Adriana and Helen Selick? <laughs> I don't know how to start explaining. Bye. Thank you. LOL, I said, and she vanished into the ether, whoever that was. Now meet M. Lauren 10. And I'm sure the picture probably looks familiar to you. Hello, how are you today? My name is Lauren and I am Mr. Hugh personal assistant. I've been instructed by Mr. Hugh to send you a message. What's your name and where do you live? If you get this message, please reply said, hi there, please send some credentials as I'm sure you're aware of the huge amount of fake manager accounts online. After verification, I'd be happy to communicate with you. Would she love hearts? said, hello, did you go away? I'd love to talk with Hugh. No, I am here, ma'am. I was busy doing some paperworks. Mr. Hugh's celebrity code is Jackman Hugh 4281 <laughs> whatever that means. Anytime you get a text from someone claiming to be him, ask of this code. And if that person doesn't get it correctly, please, that is not him. Thanks for your support and comments on his page. Mr. Hughes requested I connect you to him so he have a chat with you personally. Do you mind having a conversation with him? I said, not a code, your business credentials. Where are you based? Australia or America? Seeing as Hugh is Australian. Yes, he is an Australian, but he stays in the United States. I said, where are you based? He has a home in Melbourne near where I am. Where are you based? I am from the United Kingdom. I said, are you really? Want to try that again? But I moved to the States. Yes, I am. I said, try again. Trust me, ma'am. To which I then showed her her location again. Really, I said, amateur. I will never do anything to hurt you, she said. I said, LOL, you'll go up on my post as another one who didn't remember to turn their location off. This must have been a mixed up. I said, sure, they all say that. Yes, please. So you're telling me you work for Hugh Jackman, the Aussie star, but are located in Nigeria. And you don't want money. Laughing face, laughing face, laughing face. I can guarantee I know more about the man than you do. I'm also Aussie and live in his town. Good try, but make better choices and turn your location off. I don't want your money, please. With all due respect, ma'am, this is about the Matildas match against Nigeria. <laughs> I said, LOL, so what do you want, fake profile? And around it being the Matildas match, I said, really, what about it? We are rooting for them, and that's why I set my location on there. <laughs> said, I thought you worked for Hugh. And around the location, I said, bullshit. You saw one post, you're an idiot, you're about 22 and a boy, and have no idea about Hugh or anything about him. And you're an idiot too, she said. I said, go away. Shut up, she said. Fool, idiot. And I went LOL and sent laughing emojis, and she ran away.